Come, son of Adam. I will show you a far-off site of the castle where you are to be king. And Peter, with his sword still drawn in his hand, went with the lion to the eastern edge of the hilltop. There a beautiful sight met their eyes. The sun was setting behind their backs. That meant the whole country below them lay in the evening light. Forests and hills and valleys and winding away like a silver snake, the lower part of the great river. And beyond all this, miles away, was the sea, and beyond the sea, the sky, full of clouds which were just turning rose color with the reflection of the sunset. But just where the land of Narnia met the sea, in fact, at the mouth of the great river, there was something on a little hill shining. It was shining because it was a castle. And of course, the sunlight was reflected from all the windows which looked towards Peter and the sunset. But to Peter, it looked like a great star resting on the seashore. That, O oh man, said Aslan, is care paravel of the four thrones, in one of which you must sit as king. I show it to you because you are the firstborn, and you will be high king over the rest. <laughs>